Only a handful of teachers can say that they've seen it all. Mr. Lane and Coach Tidwell have taken the same walk from their cars to their classrooms each morning for the past 18 years. In the process of, of being here and teaching different classes and being in different roles, um, I think the one thing that you always come back to, the whole point of the profession is that you're trying to help other people improve themselves. Leaving Wakeland has never been a question for Mr. Lane. Because I put a lot of hours in it. Like, I don't, it's not just the hours. Like, I kind of have put life force into the walls of the building, right? I've seen a lot of things happen here. And I used, to, I've spent a tremendous amount of time in the building. While Mr. Lane has been spending his time in the classroom, Coach Tidwell has been a spectator of a Wakeland sports legacy. I think growing up in a, like a sports family, and my dad doing it for so long, and my brother, and my mom was a special ed teacher uh, for 30 years. I, that's just kind of how I was raised to like, even though it's challenging, you gotta work through it. And, you know, I can't imagine uh, if I would have made that choice not to come back, you know, um, I couldn't imagine what, I'm, what else I would be doing because I, I feel like I was, I'm born for this. As Coach Tidwell and Mr. Lane reflect on their time well spent at Wakeland, they look forward to the years to come. So my son has got one more year of daycare, uh, so he's got, he'll start kindergarten next year. So I've got 13 years left uh, in my career, right? And so, yes, that is the plan, is to be a Wakeland Wolverine. I just think that would be a very unique and rare uh, opportunity. For WinTV, I'm Ella Brookshire.